Hey everybody, it's Juice Turner with Love, and welcome back to another video. Today's video, we are going to talk about Fenty Skin. Now, if you guys remember from my Sephora haul, I bought some uh, travel or mini size uh, Fenty Skin. So we're going to talk about briefly about that. Um, if you guys are new to my channel, thank you for joining in. You guys are always welcome. Um, before you leave, if you like what you see, please don't forget to subscribe. And if you guys have been here, you guys already know what, know the drill. If you guys have tried Fenty Skin, please let me know your thoughts. Um, yeah, I should have. This is one of those products where I should have read the reviews before I bought. Um, now I hear hit and miss things. I hear two different opinions a little bit, but I didn't read reviews. I didn't read reviews this time. Um, and I wanted to deep dive into this product. And, uh, well, I'll talk about it. So, I haven't, I, I'm going to be honest with you. I didn't try the cleanser. Um, I made a mess with it that one day. And, yeah, I did not try it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be sadly honest. I did not try it. Why? We'll get into that right now. So, I've been using a different cleanser. I have some of my JLo cleanser, and I have a Drunk Elephant cleanser, and a Dr. Brandt cleanser. I know it's too many cleansers, but I'm, I'm trying it because I'm out of my, almost out of my JLo Beauty cleanser. And uh, um, so I'm trying to see what my skin will like. Um, now, I don't know if it's just because there's counter interactions. I don't think so. Uh, but this, so this fat water, I don't like to use the word fat, so, but this is what it's called, fat water. Don't know, you know, I mean, I don't, I know why, but that's just what she called it. It's pore refining tone serum. I used a little bit of it. I, I hate to say it. I don't care for it. It has, I think I'm, I'm used to JLo's fragrance. Um, so it's, it looks yellowish, but it's clear. And it's kind of like, you know, it goes on clear, but I don't know, it, it, it's like a peachy melon, uh, kind of scent. I don't like it. I don't like it. My skin kind of felt irritated with this toner. I don't usually use toners. Maybe that could be an issue, um, but my just my skin started uh, to break out a little bit. Um, now, along with that, her uh, Hydra Vi Visual Visual Invisible Moisture Broad of SPF thirty. Now, I you I know the amount of of um, moisturizer that I use. Um, usually, you know, and, and this is, this is, if y'all follow me, I've been using JLo Beauty, so I am comparing already, yes. This, um, that big screen, broad SPF, same, it's moisturizer, 30 plus, and this is also 30, well, this is just 30, actually, but this is 30 plus. Um, I've used this, I've been in the sun, um, I work in the sun every day, um, I don't feel being hot, I don't feel sunburned, nothing. I use this for two days or three days. Um, I felt burnt. I, I know my skin was burnt. My face was hot. I felt almost like a fever, but not a fever. But you know, when you get sunburned, you're, you're just, your skin is hot. And I had to rub aloe all over myself. So whatever, this just didn't work for me. Um, and honestly, it kind of, it made my skin, I just, I'm just kind of scared to use it. Um, I mean, I'm not, I mean, who wants to be sunburned? <laughs> who wants to be sunburned? Um, it could be my skin adjusting, but I don't want to, I don't want to chance it. So I've been, again, I, after that, I've been putting this on, no problem. Honestly, I'm, I don't know, it's just, I know I had iffies on JLo Beauty, but now trying other things, it's not working. And I know some of you, you know, JLo, cash grab, whatever. But this, I'm going to most likely buy again. It's probably, what was it, 50-some bucks? 
maybe i forgot honestly if you guys remember you remember but <laughs> um like i have millions of other just moisturizers um you know moisturizers without spf they work great um but this my skin just i don't know i i didn't like it and then i'm starting to break out um, which could just be weather, the heat, you know, it was 90 degrees one day, and then 80 degrees and 70. So, oh, temperature affects my skin. Um, but, honestly, I'm afraid to use this. This I didn't care for. And, uh, I just, I'm probably gonna, I'm gonna return these. because, And I was excited to try it. So excited to start the Fenty journey. And sadly, I'm going to tell you, this is where my Fenty journey ends. Now, I'm going to show you this because I'm just going to show it to you. So, you guys can see in case you guys didn't see my Sephora haul. So, it's it's like a pink um, moisturizer. Uh, smells like a peachy rose old lady scent. <laughs> um, but, geez. It was a little bit okay. It's still like it doesn't. Well, it does. It does. It takes a lot of rubbing into your skin. Like my skin isn't. I mean, I know my hand. I'm, my hand skin is different than my face skin. But I I always check my face before I go into work, and I I had a bunch of. It just didn't want it soak up in my skin. Um, so that was also an issue. Um, it feels tacky my skin i don't know i i don't know if you guys have tried fenty skin if you loved it i don't know if you hated it or it just didn't work well um and i was so excited to get into this and not anymore <laughs> but i want to know your guys's opinions like have you have a similar experience um did your skin like it maybe it's just my skin that's not liking it maybe it's just something i did maybe i mixed something i don't i don't know i was trying new things and um who knows who knows um but for me it's a no it is not too center my love approved <laughs> uh but sadly won't well, i don't know i won't be able to i don't know eventually we're gonna start comparing more brands um, I know you guys are going to want me to compare uh, Jeffree Star Skin whenever he comes out. I think November is some product launching. But I know, I don't know, you know, you guys are going to want me to compare Jeffree Skin with maybe Fenty Skin, Kylie Skin. <sighs> I'm scared to try Kylie Skin. But I will do it for you guys if you guys want me to. Um, and... Because I know you guys want the tea. You guys want. I know there's. We don't try to go with drama. But we want some comparisons. If you guys. Tr if there's like. Any like of these celebrity skincare brands. That you guys tried. Um, let me know. I really. I'm curious. I know I watch reviews. But I'm curious from my, my family here. What are your thoughts on these? I mean I know some place, some people. I'm not talking about like cash grabs. I want to know facts about what's happening with your skin you know is it is it working is it break, making you break out making you oily um are there some good products um just anything if the product you know starts to change color why are there bubbles i don't know anything just me i'm just saying things what i see um but this she going back um sorry she's going back um and yeah, so sorry you guys, I hate to disappoint you, but no more Fenty skin for me. Now, if somewhere along the line something changes, I can maybe revisit it, um, her line, but so far Fenty skin is not for me. Still have to try Fenty Beauty, but we'll get there one day. Um, so that is uh, it. So if you guys enjoy this video, I know it's not. It was an okay video, I know, I know. Uh, but just give it a thumbs up. Share with your friends, share with your family. If other people are curious, I know it's not a full in-depth 
uh, Fenty Skin Review, but if you guys want to beware of some things, let people know. Tag me in it. I will reshare you, comment, the hoopla of everything. Uh, but yeah, so you guys all have a great day, and I will see you again shortly. Well, I'm recording a few videos, so yeah. But yeah, bye.